Hi, in this video I want to show you how to make this storage box that I have at the Silhouette Online Store and at LoriBitlock.com in SVG format. Um, basically this little box um, will hold a 4x6 photo with a little lid and it has a little book plate on it. Uh, but it also has dividers so that you could use it to store things like brads or buttons or um, little knickknacks. So let me show you how to put this together. I've gone ahead and assembled the lid, which is assembled exactly like the base. And you'll find in the file some little covering panels that leave about an eighth of an inch gap on each side. So you can cut those out of whatever um, paper you'd like. But the base is just this big rectangle and you just need to fold all the pieces towards the center and glue the four glue flaps. It's really simple to assemble. Um, and then you'll notice in the file there's all these other pieces that have perforations on them and those are going to be the dividers. So of course if you don't want to use the dividers you wouldn't have to cut those. into place. Let all those dry really good. Okay, and while that's drying, um, you'll notice that there's a little book plate and that just goes onto the front of the box here and I need to grab some brads just a moment. set of brads. I think I'll pull out these little uh, kind of bronze looking ones. Okay, so I will line up my front and my back piece and the holes and then the holes on the box as well and just open up my little brad inside. And that way you can always remove this foot plate and change the label if you'd like. You don't have to make it a permanent fixture. Okay, so there's the book plate in place. Okay, and now all we need to do is put together our little divider pieces. And this large one, you're just gonna fold it right in half then you're gonna fold the two side wings up. And then you're just gonna take that whole piece and just slip it down inside the box. And that creates a center divider. Now to, to create the dividers down the side, you are going to just take two of these and do the exact same thing, fold it in half, fold the wings up. And this is going to create half of it and this is going to create half of it and you can glue them together in that center panel there. And then you're gonna do the same thing for the other side. And you can go ahead and put some glue in between the center piece as well to hold it nice and flat. So go ahead and glue those flat. And it just leaves you with this piece that looks like this. And you'll end up with four of those. So those to glue down nice and flat. are drying. I think these are probably done. Okay, so um, this can go in here and this one can go here. And you can glue those together on that center piece if you'd like or if you'd like to keep them separated that's fine too. Um, oops, this one's coming apart. This will allow you to have separate little sections for brads or buttons or whatever you would like to store in this cute little box. And the lid just goes on like this. And you have this great little 
storage box and you could make several of them and stack them together with brads and buttons and our jewelry or whatever you'd like to store in them. So I hope you enjoy making this cute little box and that you find it useful.